Got a question from a customer today about transparent pixels in textures. So I'll show you what they are asking and I'll show you a quick solution. So here I've got one of the new graphics that's on the way for the lake time collection. And let's say I wanted to add some plastisol distress. I've got one of the plastisol um, brushes here. You'll see it's like a big stamp brush. You can size it up or down. And the way the Photoshop brushes work is the best way to use them is with a layer mask. So let's go to layer, layer mask, reveal all, then we'll paint pixels, black pixels into that layer mask. But the thing is with layer masks, let me zoom in here, is sometimes you'll get some sort of semi-transparent pixels. I don't know if you can see that, but if you are sending your designs out to a printer, sometimes, especially if it's like a transparent PNG image, they can't or won't accept images that have partial transparency. So the easy solution here is make sure you've got this layer mask highlighted and just go to image adjustments threshold and that'll force all those pixels in that layer mask to completely black or white which means 100 percent opaque or 100 percent transparent uh, for the texture areas and you can move this slider you know if you want the texture to be chunkier you can move it to the right if you want it to be a little more subtle you move it to the left and we'll just click OK now when you zoom in you'll see those pixels are 100 percent black and white let me turn off the background here so you can see they're 100 percent transparent showing through to the background thanks for watching